Baha'i communities worldwide, inspired by Abdul Baha's life and work as a herald of peace and upholder of the principle of the oneness of humanity, have been commemorating the centenary of his passing. At the same time, representatives of Baha'i communities from nations and regions around the world journeyed to the Holy Land for a historic gathering to honor him in the very land where he passed away. prepared themselves spiritually for the gathering, visiting Baha'i holy places associated with the lives of Baha'u'llah and Abdul Baha. After days of visits to Baha'i holy places, participants assembled at the concourse of the seat of the Universal House of Justice for the start of the formal program. It is with tremendous joy that I welcome all of you, dear friends, to this historic gathering. Today, People from all walks of life, representing many millions, are gathered here. By all accounts, the beloved Master remains with us, a precious gift to all of humanity. We turn our thoughts to every heart connected to Abdul Baha and say to them, the presence of each of you is missed. Our hearts are filled with wonder as we contemplate the significance of this momentous occasion. 
In these uncertain times, the friends turn with hope and longing to Abdul Baha, that shelter of all mankind, a shield unto all who are in heaven and on earth, beseeching his assistance from the realms above as they endeavor to follow his example in the path of service. During the coming days, when the thoughts of the believers all around the world are focused on that sacred and glorious being, you have the blessing and privilege of paying homage to him on behalf of your communities in those very spots where he labored day and night for the promotion of the cause of God and for the betterment of humankind. How blessed we are to witness the uniting force of the faith of Baha'u'llah through the presence of friends from diverse backgrounds, languages, and cultures, women and men from literally every corner of the world on this historic occasion. It is in moments like this that I call to mind Baha'u'llah's words, that the soul of every prophet of God, of every divine messenger, hath wished to witness this wondrous day. And we are alive today. A special exhibit at the seat of the Universal House of Justice explored aspects of the life of Abdul Baha and how he guided the development of the Baha'i community. Early hours of Saturday, 27 November 2021, attendees gathered in the courtyard of the Haifa Pilgrim House in a solemn and reverent atmosphere to mark the ascension of Abdul Baha. A century has now elapsed since the noble spirit of Abdul Baha ascended to its eternal home. day, so many of the friends who embraced the faith absorbed the spirit of the divine teachings simply by observing him. And still today, if we wish to align our lives with that same spirit, 
we look to the example set by the Master, whose word and deed reflected the brilliance of the light that shone from Baha'u'llah's revelation. Every community building endeavor undertaken today, every educational activity and every outreach carries with it the hope of communicating through our own efforts, a token of the same love he showered upon every soul. Such efforts are the best tribute that can be rendered to him at this centenary and every day that follows. As the local friends gain experience and increasingly develop the attitudes and the qualities associated with service to humanity, they are encouraged to support others within their neighborhood or village who are walking a similar path, in which learning is the mode of operation, in which souls labor together ceaselessly, delighting not so much in their own accomplishments, but in the progress and services of others. In honoring the person of Abdul Baha, we have been able to draw closer to him, having partaken spiritual bounties from the shrines. You are now ready to take back the spirit of the event, to feed and to give life to your communities. Thank you.